Dr. Franklin here at the Pioneer Maker Academy at Wayland Baptist University. Did you know that you can find the volume of your prints, your 3D models, directly in uh, Autodesk Mesh Mixer? That is so hard to say. I don't know why I keep trying to say it. Mesh Mixer, Mesh Mixer, Mesh Mixer, Mesh Mixer. Anyway, it is quick and it is easy. It is easy and it's not where I thought it would be, so I'm going to show you how to find it and do it yourself. All right, so we open Mesh Mixer, and first thing we're going to do is import our model from either an STL file or an OBJ file. So I go to Import, find something that I want to find the volume of. I'm going to pick something random. How about a uh, nice little Majora's Mask? I could pick something that didn't take so long to generate, but there we go. So what is the volume of this? So it's going to be under analysis. That made sense to me. I thought it was going to be under measure, measure, as in like measure the volume, but no, it's under stability. If you find stability, there it is. Not only are you finding the volume, which is 14,583.9 cubic millimeters, you can find the surface area, which is 8,258.29 millimeters, or the center of mass, which is that nice pretty little green thing right there in the middle. And there you go. That's the volume of your model.